Now that you have signed up for an OpenGov account, you can begin the process of submitting your application. If you have not signed up to create an account, please close this video and watch the OpenGov introductory video first. I click the box that says Licking County Planning Commission, where you will then see all of our applications listed. For a lot split, scroll down the page until you see the Minor Land Division Lot Split application and click on the blue box. This page contains some basic information regarding lot splits along with a blue box in the upper right hand corner that says apply online. Click on this blue box to begin your application. From there, you'll be prompted to enter your contact information followed by the address, parcel number, or select the location of the property by pinpoint on a map. Then you will need to enter the applicant's information, whether that is you as the parcel owner or an agent acting on behalf of the parcel owner. You will then be asked to specify certain things like whether the parcel is on an ODOT road. Next, you'll enter specific information regarding the proposed lot split, such as acreage, the type of split, purchaser information, the parcel number, and the number of parcels being split. Once that is complete, you will then be prompted to upload required documents. Required documents may include township zoning approval, water and wastewater health department approval, driveway approval, legal descriptions for the parcels being split, a survey map of the split, a copy of the current deed, and a copy of the current tax map of the parcel. After all required documents are uploaded, you can continue to the last step by navigating to the bottom of your screen and clicking next. You will then have the opportunity to review your application before formally submitting it to our office. After the application is submitted, you will see your account dashboard where you can view pending applications, messages, projects, permits, and track payments you've submitted. You will be sent automatic notifications to your email if additional information is needed and when your lot split has been approved. After approval, the signed and notarized deed will still need to be brought into our office for review and a stamp before moving through the final steps of the recording process and finalizing the lot split. As always, our staff is here to help if you have any questions.